Oh, there we are. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back. It is March 28, 2019. I hope everybody's having an awesome day. Wait, what is it? Is it it's third is it Thursday? Wow. Is tomorrow Friday? Man, look at that. Already end of the week. Lost track of time, but um yeah. Yeah. We got we got some good stuff coming up. Um anyway, uh if you're new to the channel, I do this live every single day every day, Monday through Friday. I mean Saturday and Sunday, we just don't count those. Anyway, uh all day no i don't do it all day i just do it 10 p.m eastern standard time sorry i'm reading something over here on the side and it's just totally sidetracking me anyway guys i'm here now me and you monday through friday 10 p.m eastern standard time if you're watching this after the fact and you're not live you could be live if you make it that time and if you are live i thank you for being here now i want to give a shout out to the early birds in the chat rafael jesse what's up bro jose martinez jay bohannon robert burns CR, Mr. Nutson, Crypto Mikel, Brad Cromer, Jason Sides, TH, and Jason Sides again. He gets a double shout out. Those were the early birds for today. Thank you all for being here and uh, commenting in the live stream before it even got started. Oh, and Yashnik. Never, never, uh, oh, and, and Serial Thriller. See, now just people are going to. Okay. Back to uh, our, our business at hand and what the title is talking about. AMD's next Navi GPUs could have the specs and ray tracing to beat nvidia what what are we talking about this is from tech radar it's an article i'll put the article down below in the description so if you want to click on it yourself but we're going to dissect this because i have no idea how um they're going to be beating the specs of any any nvidia cards maybe last generation um amd's future navi gpus the successor to vega 2 may have the power that enthusiasts are looking for rumor has it that the new navi gpus may launch later this year with a follow-up Navi 20 GPU launching next year, according to YouTube channel Red Gaming Tech. Okay, so cool beans. More importantly, the GPU is expected to offer improved performance and even ray tracing on par with the NVIDIA RTX 2080 Ti. Wow. Wow. How much are we going to have to pay for this? Nobody knows. I'm, I'm going to be, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and try to predict the future here. AMD is not dropping a graphics card that's going to beat the, the RTX 2080 Ti for anywhere in the same price range. If they drop a graphics card that's better than the RTX 2080 Ti, it's going to be double the price. I hate to be... You know what? I'm not bashing on NVIDIA or AMD, I, and it's not like I'm an NVIDIA fanboy. It's just history... You know, history and stuff and things. All those combined together... Um, we're looking for AMD to be our budget savior. We don't need them to be the biggest, baddest boy on the block. We want that $300 card that gets us 90 mega hash. That's what we want. AMD, listen here. Okay, we need the RX 680 Ti edition times three. That's what we need. And we need it cheap, all right? Um, let's, let's read on a little bit before I get too sidetracked. Earlier this year, AMD launched the Radeon 7 graphics card without confirming whether the new GPU built on 7 nanometer architecture was actually Vega 2 or still considered part of the original Vega family. In any case, the Radeon 7 may just be a stopgap as it doesn't perform competitively with Nvidia's best graphics card, the RTX 2080 Ti. Never too late for Navi. The new Vega architecture should help push AMD's performance ahead of where it currently stands, and this isn't the first time we've heard a rumor that a Navi could arrive later this year. Given how competitive the Radeon 7 is with the RTX 2080, Navi could be big. The first iteration of the new GPU architecture, Navi 10, is expected to be a mid-tier offering. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, and a version of the Navi 10 could be used in future consoles. The, though the new Navi GPUs are believed to have an improved GCN architecture, it still may leave NVIDIA's expensive RTX 2080 Ti at the top of the pack. But the Navi 20 version is rumored to come later this year that could shake things up by bringing even more power in AMD's own recipe for ray tracing. Then we just have to wait and see whether NVIDIA has a response in the form of new RTX GPUs. So, what I'm taking away from this article is Navi 10 might be our savior. Navi 20, I think they're shooting too high. You know, like, 
what do they say shoot for the moon shoot for the sun land on the moon or something like that i don't know i don't know how the saying goes i just know navi 10 all right we need to dissect this navi 10 how many mega hash is that 100 we need 100 mega hash out of navi 10 and we need it to cost 249 dollars done done instant winner amd you can hire me my email address is down below i'll um I, yeah that's it that's all it takes uh <laughs> anyway um whew, yeah let's uh let's get back to the normal stuff let's check out the market sorry guys i have um not kept up with the live stream chat here i'll i'll, I'll catch up here in a second uh taking a look at the market bitcoin is sitting at, at a healthy four thousand and seventy three dollars so up from its uh just below that four thousand dollar mark yesterday ethereum's at 139 dollars and 64 cents sitting in the number two spot uh litecoin's down in the number five slot uh at 61 dollars 19 cents we're looking at bitcoin cash in the sixth spot at 170 dollars and 48 cents and cruising on down a little bit more bitcoin satoshi's vision actually dropped down a little bit it's in the 12th spot at 64 dollars 58 cents followed by monero in the 13th spot at 53 dollars 91 cents and then if we keep on going down look at that Ooh, ethereum classic lost uh lost its spot it was in the 19th spot it's now in the 20th spot at four dollars 78 cents a coin bam look at that people um all right so let's uh some notable mentions as always for our bitcoin diamond lovers we'll check on bitcoin diamond it's up to 85 cents up about 1.8 percent um what about grin are people grinning let's see all the grin holders look at that it's up 3.6 percent two dollars 58 cents what about the beam me up scotty coins Ooh, down a little bit 79 cents scotty's not getting beamed up today um and now everybody's favorite bird raven coin six cents we're looking at 6.6 6 cents there's a lot of sixes there i don't know what that means um but really the the, the amazing thing we're looking at 1638 satoshis raven just fly away that's going to be the new thing fly to the moon we ain't on a rocket ship we're on a raven to the moon what are you posting in there we're not we're not looking at the we're not looking at that not yet that'll be over here to the side um let's see here what uh did we forget any other coins nerva we haven't looked at nerva in a while yep everybody's gonna be driving their raven lambos here in a minute nerva Ooh, not doing so good on nerva what about etho ether one ether one 183 satoshis so it's actually down another 20 percent what is ether one doing it's like bam 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 um i still got my ether one maybe i should get more maybe i should sell it nobody knows uh micro bitcoin Ooh, sitting on the bottom at two satoshis micro bitcoin on sale what's the yeah Oh, yes, Nick, asking about the uh, the ever-elusive Aeon. Aeon sitting at the 15.5 cent range, holding that, holding it down. Yes, Nick, when, when can we expect our $15 Aeon? Guys, pay attention to the live live chat right now. Yes, Nick's going to let you know when, when you Aeon holders are going to be blue, bloody rich. Or maybe he won't. Maybe he'll just keep it for himself. Anyway... Anyway, oh, BAT, yeah, BAT's a good one to look at. Our basic attention token. BAT, 26 cents. Ooh, look at that. A nice spicy 13% rise over the last 24 hours. I did not snub you, but thank you for that $2 donation. I got 15 bucks for, yeah. <laughs> I heard you on that one. Okay, so before we, uh, we get over to the graphics cards, I... Thank you for that donation there, Booster Bros, for the $2. The $2. I did want to show the Booster Bros has got uh, some cards for sale. I will put, well, the link is in, in the live chat right now. But they're Power Color Red Dragon RX 574 gigs. There are 10 available, and they're 90 bucks a pop with $5 shipping. So look at that, ladies and gentlemen. RX 570 Red Dragoons. Red Dragoons. Fresh out the mining shed. 90 bucks a pop 
hit up Booster Bros in um, the Discord, or you can actually just click on the eBay link and uh, check them out. Well, bam. All right. So Yasnik says, cat, no cat. What's up, Michael Schubert? Michael, oh, I see. Only 15. Yeah, I see. That's all it's going to take, man. $15. Woo! What about that $150 Aeon? Brave Browser is making headway, FTA. It is. I've actually got, I finally got back into my account. Booster Bros donated $2. Nah, bro, you snubbed me so rude. Oh, I'm sorry. Thank you for the additional $2 donation. And uh, I'm sorry that, that you feel like I snubbed you. I, it won't happen again. But thank you. Um, basic attention token, 26 cents. I got some bat. I got some bat. They want my identity, though. They have to, the KYC, every. Everything's know your customer nowadays. It's, it's making me err. Anyway, that's a whole nother video. Let's take a look at what the graphics cards are doing. So if you look up here, ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, a chart showing each and every single different one of graphics cards that I own. I do obviously own multiples of these, so but the data for multiples wouldn't be good for you. So it just shows like one against one. Um, everything, the Raven skyrocketed again today, went up like 20 to 30%. Uh, mining on Kudo Miner. Uh, it's auto switching. Done says, please, please stop being rude to Booster Bros. And Booster Bros says, when wedding, need to lose weight. Man, I, dude, I trimmed down when I got the flu, and I'm actually I'm trying to put the weight back on because I don't fit into my my wedding clothes. I don't have my wedding clothes yet, so that's actually that's actually not true. But anyway, you know what I'm saying. And I, guys, I ain't been drinking my Mountain Dew. I'm losing weight by not drinking Mountain Dew. Please stop being rude to Booster Bros. Well, okay, thank y'all for the additional two dollars and two dollars, Booster Bros. And done. Um, what else do we have here? Ethereum saw a good five six percent rise over the last twenty four hours on the RX, the AMD cards. And um, look at that, the RTX twenty seventy almost doing a full dollar a day um, mining Raven on the Kudo Miner software. So, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we're this is a good time to be mining. Good time to be holding, good time to be mining. It's a good time to be in crypto all the way around. So if you want to look at this a little bit more in depth, go ahead and pause the video now. You can pause it or uh, pause the live stream because you can uh, you can pause live. See, we were just paused right there for a second. Now, uh, let's get back to it. And um, Anthony Jones... <laughs> Is crypto back? Crypto has been back, bro. Been back. Uh, Booster Bros donated two dollars. I bought four hundred packs of Shining Legends. Holy smokes! Uh, hopefully you got them for like a dollar a pack, right? Nub, you need. I, I'm about to get you out of here, Mr. Nub. Anyway, uh, Amazon deal of the day. Cruising through Amazon, and I saw this SanDisk cruiser. Look at that. I was cruising, and here's a cruiser. 64 gig USB 2.0 flash drive. Um, it It's not the fastest, because it's only USB 2.0, but uh, I picked up one of these. Well, where is it? Hold on. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Uh, I picked up one of these, and I'm actually just going to leave it plugged into the back of my computer and use it for just some, you know, junk files every now and then and uh, backing up stuff too. And it's kind of like a little, you know, little hot swappable storage. So I'm just using it as extra storage. Obviously, you can use it for whatever you want. I just thought 10 bucks for 64 gigs. Hard to believe that, like, we live in amazing times. I remember when I was in high school. Oh, my God, dude. A 64 gig flash drive was un it, unheard of, unthought of, like... If somebody would have showed me, oh, dude, this flash drive is a 64 gig, like, I would have been like, you are crazy. You are lying to me right now. Or that thing would be cost like a couple hundred dollars, maybe more. So there's an Amazon affiliate link down below for this flash drive. If you use that link, it helps me out and I appreciate you. Um, if you want to use my link and help me out, but you don't want to buy this USB drive, just click on that link anyway. It'll open up a screen just like this and just search in the top what you want to actually buy. If you're on that screen, still helps me out and i appreciate you so yeah oh my god booster bros spent 1300 dollars on packs of shining legends Woo. makes my heart hurt right there um 
Beers for some likes, Michael Schubert. Yes, sir. He knows how to. He knows how the game is. Uh, so checking in over on the Twitter sphere, we are up to 414 followers. So guys, if you want to keep up to date with what's going on, follow me over on Twitter. I also post whenever we're doing giveaways or any side stuff going on. Twitter is the best way, other than Discord, to keep up with uh, the the new the new new. If y'all want to stay on the new new, you know what I'm saying. I got a notification. NBC web developer followed me. Awesome. Thank you, NBC web developer. Not yet, Nub. Um, apparently, Little Uzi had to shout out Bitcoin one time in that new music video. What? Little Uzi shouted out at Bitcoin. Woo! Um, let's check out the rig of the day for today. And we actually need some more rigs of the day. For, to show off for our rig of the day to get there you go to reddit.com and slash and search brandon coin or down below in the description way down in there you can click on brandon coin reddit and that'll bring you over here then you can post up some pictures you can do a walk around video and a good example is let's show uh, off wmx 99 so he's got a youtube channel uh wmx 99 web mr webmaster um Rig of the day, he's got two 1080 Ti's, four the win, three hybrids, and a server case. These were my old gaming cards. I used an SLI. I put them in a server case, and I'm testing the $130, 1600-watt non-modular power supply from Amazon. Overkill for two GPUs, but wanted to compare with the EVGA 1600 fully modular power supply I have. I had these in an open-air rig for a short time, but only GPU mine with server case going forward. I have 18 GPUs total, four ASICs that I run on a regular basis, losing about 150 to 200 per month, but still have profits left over from 2017 with dollar cost averaging on my BitPay card to go towards electric. Well, awesome that you're still staying in it, even though you're technically not profiting. Um, and let's check out what you got going on here. Ooh, pretty cool server case. Whoa, super high res picture, man. Interesting setup there. Let's see here. Oh, he's got it torn apart. I have seen that that power supply before. It's uh, it's like the Bitcoin my It's a, it's like advertises like a Bitcoin mining power supply. Um, very cool. These are some baller cards right here. He's got the radiators over to the side, so it's just sucking the heat right out of this thing. Wonder what CPU he's got. Cause he's got a couple sticks of RAM in there, so he might have a decent little CPU in there never know um yeah what else did you show on here active miners two gpus a dollar 15 a day what's he mining oh he's mining ethereum oh wmx 99 get those things off of ethereum and get them on ravencoin bro those things could be making like 250 a day right now you're losing out on on like a dollar something a day man get those bad boys on ravencoin hit me up wmx 99 if you um Obviously, you probably don't need any help because you're you're smarter than I am. But if you want any help, I would gladly give it to you. Hit me up on Discord. Um, and then here's his ASICs. Got three Bitcoin ASICs, two unspecified Ethereum. Oh, Ethereum ASICs, two Bitcoin Gold, one Equihash. So awesome! Looks like he's doing twenty dollars a day on ASICs. Who knows what kind of power those things are pulling, but. Thank you for sharing your setup, WMX99. And if you need any help, bro, shout, or jump over and I will help you. No problem. No problem at all. Robert Burns says, my ASRock H110 Pro BTC motherboard for $19.95 shipped on eBay is now booting on my rig. Ah, oh, very nice to get a $20 mining motherboard. Oh, there's Mr. 751 himself. That's better. He's, he's cracking them beers together. Booster Bros, I have... Four to five 1200 watt P2 EVGA Platinum power supplies for sale. But guys, if you need any power supplies, hit up Booster Bros in the Discord. Logic Fancy, what's up, man? Nice to see you in the live chat. Glad to have you here. Glad to have you here. So we're ne we're nearing the end of the live chat. How I hope everybody's having a a great Thursday. Let me um I'm drinking a little bit of uh cherry limeade tonight, so I don't have quite the energy. Didn't didn't uh, didn't drink any energy drinks tonight, but still having a good one, enjoying it. 
en enjoying it. Boom. It's mining. Logic Fancy, do you think I could do a rig based on LGA 775? Uh, I mean, I probably wouldn't do a dedicated rig on 775, but if you already have the hardware, go ahead and, I mean, I'd run a, a card in it. You're going to be losing a little bit of power on the CPU. I just don't know if 775, you can run more than, what is it, three or four graphics cards on 775? I'm not sure. I'm not up to date on, on my older tech. Like only two cards. Yeah, yeah. If you're only doing two cards, you should be fine on 775. Not an issue. Not an issue at all, man. Let them things run. Especially if you're going to run run like on Linux. Oh, I caught it before it actually came in. Crafty2 with his $4 of Canadian maple syrup money. That good old Can Canadian $4. What's the exchange rate on $4 of Canadian maple syrup money to US? I don't know, but I will take it. Thank you, Crafty2, getting those those doges mining in the caves, bro. Logic Fancy, I'm going to use Kudo OS. Yeah, you should have no problem either using Kudo OS, Simple Miner, Hive. Anything based off of Linux would definitely be something I would direct you to. Oh, those Canadian pesos, yep. You're absolutely right. And Logic, if you need any help, shoot me a message on Discord, and I can try to get you sorted out. FTA said he needs some IHOP. I'd love some IHOP right now. Yeah, IHOP would be perfect, Booster Bros. Holy smokes, I need it. We could get a Waffle House. Waffle House is open. Oh, man. Man. So, ugh. before I get off of here, I just wanted to talk to y'all a little bit. We got, um, we, got some, we got some giveaways coming up. Not only on Brandon Coin. But we got a giveaway coming up right now on Booster Bros. And I'm actually the one that's sponsoring it. So, with that being said, let me let me just let me just show y'all something. Bam. We got we got some got some money right here. These are graded cards. These are money. Cash money. Booster Bros, thank you for the two dollars, and I do know I do need a haircut. Yeah, giveaway. All right, so just a little teaser. Um, obviously, I will post the uh, the link in the live chat. But um, yeah, these are graded cards. It costs money to actually get them graded, and for them to grade out high, like a a ten, is uh, means it's a perfect card and means it's worth even more money. So even if you don't care about cards, but you care about money, you're gonna want to be a part of this. Because all you got to do is go over to the Booster Bros channel, which there's a link down below in the description, and and I'm gonna put I'm gonna put the link in the live chat right now. If I can get it over there, yes I can. Link in the live chat. Go over there, watch that. It explains it, and um, you can you can win it. You can in it to win it if you know what I mean, guys. Anybody out there? Blue eyes, white dragon, bringing back memories. Logic fancy. Can I mine on them? No, but you can sell them. Guys, guys. I'm... Fat Pikachu. What else do we got here? Ooh, ooh. All the feels right here. All the feels. I'm hold on. Just I'm gonna show y'all one more. And then th that's it. No, 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 no. OG holographic Charizard Mint 9. Oh my goodness. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. So we got we got a lot of stuff happening over on the Booster Bros channel. You have to be subscribed, and you got to go over there and follow the directions. Super easy. It's basically just commenting. You don't really have to do any like. I'm not, I'm not gonna be one of those. Um, I'm not gonna be one of the YouTubers not calling anybody out because I, you got to respect the hustle. But they're like, all right, guys. So we're gonna do a giveaway. We need you to copy this link, put it over here, share it, tweet it. Send it to Facebook, uh, roll it down the hill, grab it, mail it, come back over here, subscribe to these 50 other channels, comment on every single exact video, send me $5, and then you have a 50% chance of being entered in, and uh, everybody's a winner half of the time, sometimes 10% of the times. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, yeah.
So, thank you all for being here. Uh, I really do appreciate it. We're having a good time. You know, you know what I'm saying. What, what are we missing out here? Um... Missing the live chat here. I just, um, yeah. Good. Preach it, bro. Yeah, preach it. I'm gonna be, I, like, I always hated giveaways and I never participated in giveaways on other channels because it's like, I, I'm not, I'm gonna forget something. There's no way I'm gonna be able to do all that and then be able to win it. Like, it's just way too much. So, yeah. Good odds. Yeah, right now, the channel's like, the channel's got, 39 subscribers so like your odds are better than ever and i'm gonna start doing a weekly giveaway over there so just stay in it and you'll see the videos and yeah you easy giveaways right now easy money easy money okay dude i need a haircut look at this it'd be like a hair model you know what i'm saying i got a brown dot yeah, that's like a... Oh, hold on. Yeah, that's like a, a mole or something. Someone's sniping you. Getting sniped. Yep. Bring back the bowl haircut. No, I was thinking we cut the front, right? We cut all the front, and we just left it back. Just floof out. Like, it's already starting, guys. Woo! Joe Dirt in the house, boys! What's up? <laughs> you know what I'm saying. I'm going to send you that GMA link. I want to thank everybody for coming out. The live stream is pretty much over. Yeah, we're mullet nation. <laughs> Dude, it's like, it's super fluffy right now. Oh my goodness. Uh, it's kind of embarrassing. But you, hey, y'all are family. Y'all only make fun of me as much as anybody else. And I appreciate that. Business in the front, party in the back. Mr. Foo Fighter in the house. Jason Sides, no mullets in North Carolina. You're absolutely right. Uh, my hair goes to the middle of my back right now. Holy smokes. He did. He did. Booster Bros met me in person. It was crazy. I almost died. <laughs> Literally. Literally. Alright, guys. So, thank y'all for coming out. Um, I'll be over in the Discord. If you want to come hang, please come over to the Discord. <laughs> no, but it was sick. Yeah, I got sick. That's what happened. Jason Sides said, only in West Virginia. Only in Western Virginia. Western Virginia. All right, guys. Peace out. Adios. My dog in here. My dog's not in here. I need to go get my dog. Um, we'll see y'all tomorrow night, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, like normal, Monday through Friday. Don't forget it. Be there. Be square. Or yeah, all that other stuff. Also, you can check out. I did a video. It's just uh, got uploaded today. Don't look at my super dirty mess. But um, this system right here. Did a video on cleaning it up and uh, put a little bit of horsepower in it. We put an RX 560 uh, 4 gig in that old AMD A8 a quad core. Um, got it up to snuff with some new windows, 8 gigs of DDR3. And it's actually listed on eBay for sale. But uh, in the video, I go through everything. Um, are you moving? Yeah, I am moving. Yeah, the, the new house is just not ready yet. I, <laughs> Foo Fighters says both. Uh, not a lie. But yeah, I'm moving and hoarding. Um, anyway, go check out that that video. It's it's cool. And if you want if you want the computer, bam, you can get a computer too. Why is the camera lounging on your chair, nub? But that's because I already told y'all this. Your office looks clean. Yeah, my office is nasty. See, like I was doing some some um, I was doing some cinematic stuff right here, and I don't have like one of those fancy tripods that like gets like a like a turning shot. So I put the camera on there, and I was like this, like, like I was getting the panning shots, like cinematic and stuff, you know? Yeah. See, I'm giving away all my secrets again. Y'all, y'all getting my secrets? Got to You got to pay to see these secrets. You don't have a gimbal? No, I don't have a gimbal. Right here's my gimbal, man. Fancy. I know, right? Yeah, I know. Um, all right, guys, so for real, I'm gone this time. Billy, Booster Bros, Nub, Foo Fighter, y'all have a good one. Anybody else that's still in here, peace out. Bye. Logic Fancy, bye.